everybody, Stu Carter here from Atomani.com, and have you ever said this to yourself? You know, I love my big tin toys, but sometimes I just want to blow them up. Well, Toy Maker Bandai has been listening to you, and they've come out with an entirely new line of big tin toys, the Alien Creation Battle Launchers. They'll give you that smash and crash action that you crave in the big tin characters that you know and love. I've got three new ones here to show you. We're going to open them up and take a look, see how they work. I've got one for Jet Ray, I've got one for uh, Humongousaur, and I've got one for Swampfire. So stand by for a new toy review. Here's a good look at the package for Swampfire. You can see it consists of basically your three inch uh, alien mini figure. These are just like, it looks just like the alien creation chamber figures that you've uh, known from a couple years. It includes a little key that helps take them apart. Uh, also includes a vehicle stylized after that alien. So here's a vehicle for Swamp Fire and a launcher device. And we've got these for Swamp Fire and, and here's the Jet Ray package. And here's the Mugglesaur package. If you were on, uh, if you were a frequent visitor to BenTinToys.net, you would have seen an early sneak peek at these. I showed these live on camera. Here's a look at the back of the package. Gives an idea about what's going to happen when these two collide. We're going to test it out and see just how they work. Here's another look at them out of the package. What you get, uh, I get in the vehicle, you get the three inch uh, mini figure with the key and the launcher. And I forgot to mention, you get a uh, special alien combo card. These combo cards are not like the usual uh, alien creation figure combo cards here. They're meant for the vehicles. So the combinations of the aliens on the vehicle. So here's one, uh, you know, uh, for well, it's Humongous Horror's vehicle. And here's one with uh, Jet Ray's vehicle. And uh, here's one with uh, Swamp Fire's vehicle. And also, uh, all these guys come with a sticker sheet. Pretty cool sticker sheet. Let's get close on this. And uh, it's the same sticker sheet for all of the guys. Uh, but it's got some nice vintage graphics. I, I imagine you could put some of these on the car and then some you might want to just put on your notebook or locker or something. Alright, and of course they come on these highly detailed and complicated directions on how to play with these vehicles. Okay, let's give it a try. Okay, here's a close-up of the guys. Three inch mini figures, alien creation figures, and help me out guys. I don't remember if we actually had these versions of alien creation figures before. I, I know we had some of these characters, but I don't know if they're the same versions. Uh, help me out in comments and let me know if I'm right or wrong. Here's a good look at Humongousaur's car. And we're going to put him on that in here. So this one fires car. It's got some nice fins. Always nice to have fans. Oh, and Jet Ray's got some good. It's a jet. It's a jet looking car. That's a pretty cool car. Okay, here's how you do it. When these guys are ready to drive the car, they gotta leave their legs behind, all right? It's just the heads and arms, so you take your little key here, and you pop them apart, so you get all the pieces apart. There. And you just need his head. The longest where his head goes on the top, and his arms go on the side. Like so. Right? And then you've got a launcher with a little flat, a little lever here. You just push it into the launcher. Oh, his head came off. There. And now to launch him, you just push on this. He's going to take off. All right. Okay, so here's Monker Sword, his car. He's ready to go. There's Swamp Fire in his car. And. Here's Jet Ray in his car. Now let's go to the Atomani.com test track and see how these work. Humongousaur versus the wall. Jet Ray versus the wall. Swamp Fire versus the wall. Okay, that's my look at the Bin 10 Alien Creations Battle Launchers by Bandai. 
you're gonna to wanna to subscribe to this channel because I've got more Ben 10 toys to show you and they'll be coming up just as soon as possible. So hang around and subscribe. Have a good night.